Welcome to YouTube video presentation of this 2005 Newmar Mountaineer Model 3743. It's kind of getting dark here, almost 7 o'clock. I've got a little light here. I don't know if that can make a difference or not. It's a full body paint, workhorse chassis, uh, Newmar, trade-in motorhome. Let me repeat, trade-in, not a repo. It's got about 32,000 miles, workhorse chassis, full body paint. Take a look at this. I mean, chrome view mirrors, rear view mirrors. It's a Newmar quality. We got a Alcoa aluminum wheels with a 2015. I think there's some are 20, like late 41, 14, and some are like a first week of a 15. These are 14 and 15 year old Michelin tires. That translates into about $3,500 to $4,000. dollars 3500 to $4,000. Take a look at the uh, slide out topper in great shape. No tattered up. Again, it's not a repo. We got a window awning here that comes out. It's a cloth awning, full body paint. Let's back up and see if you can see anything better in this. And this daylight is almost gone, but take a look at it. It's beautiful. Please take a look at all my pictures. Beautiful full body paint, three slide outs, and we're going to sell it for under wholesale. So grab it while you can. It will not last. Again, this is a uh, three of 15. So third week of 15 when the Michelin had manufactured this tire. By the time they put it in, probably 2015. So they're about a year old tires or less than that. Again, slide out topper in great shape. We've got two slides. You'll take a look at it. I'll show you any scratches. I can see some, some imperfection. Oh, that's just a, maybe a little chip right there. Uh, no, it wasn't even chip. Okay, so I'll show you there are some scratches on the other side. If you get really close on this uh, full body paint, you can see some sun damage, but overall it's a, it looks really nice. I mean, I've got this LED light. It's just blasting at it. Uh, 50 amp power cord, got 7,000 watts generator. Let's talk about that. Let me show that generator. Is it here? Yes, it is. 7,000 watts generator. I believe it's got about 1,100 hours and runs great. Two roof air conditioners, and they may have heat pumps. Just take a look at all my description. Some little scratch here, nothing bad. Take a look at it back here. Got a 5,000 watt pounds towing capacity hitch with the seven pin plug full paint got a solid proprietary roof it's not a rubber roof it's kind of like a, a fiberglass roof that's what Newmar makes a few more little light scratches here and cut some chip marks but no body damage beside that no dam dings or big damage got two slides on the bedroom Beautiful skin. It's like a champagne, uh, mocha, chocolate color, and a gray it, all into it. A uh, few scratches here again uh, on our compartment doors on this side. I think they're. Take a look at inside. Take a look at this. It's got pass through storage. It goes all the way to the other side. Got a Weather Pro A and E electric patio awning. Let's take a look at that. It's made out of a cloth, not a vinyl. A cloth is a much better. This electric awning has a controller inside and in and uh, one outside right here. Some more storage room. Very clean. Again, it's once again it's a trading, not a repo. Usually you find a lot more flaws in a repo coaches. It's an obvious thing that when you can't make a payment, you can't take care of motor. I mean a lot of time when it becomes repossessed and goes through litigation from bank to the auction yard. Who knows who gets into it and what happens. Anyways, that's my analogy. I don't know. All right, come on in. We took our shoes off. Very clean coach inside. Uh, I don't need my light anymore. It got, looks like someone has changed carpet. Okay, uh, so it's new carpet, no stains. Let's start from front over here. Fires right up. Got Tilt the wheel, turn my lights on here. 32,294 miles. That's barely nothing for this workhorse. 8.1 liter uh, engine. Got a color backup monitor. Has a couple of more inputs. If you'd like to put side cameras, knock yourself out, you, get, you can do that for a few hundred bucks. Got a CD player up on top. It's hooked up to this cassette player. It's got a multi CD over here. Take a look at this. No gear with the hand. It's got a push button Allison transmission. It's a five speed. Allison transmission. Got a HWH leveling jacks. 
you can see it right here. Uh, got a great brakes. That's kind of like imitating diesel pushers that they have a exhaust brake. So it's got a great brake when you go in the mountains or stuff. And emergency brake is here. It almost imitates the diesel pusher. It's a gas coach, but it, it's got the stuff of diesel pusher. Speaking of that, take a look at this. We got electric uh, sun sun uh, visor or right here for driver side. And let me go on a passenger side and show you that too. So while well, you're sitting here, electric sun visor, nice little table here to put your iPad or laptop, and you just do this and it goes back in. It's got a little, oh, you can adjust them too, whatever you want it, and get it all the way back. All right, we even have a glow box. How about that? A motorhome that has a glow box. You can put your registration, maps, whatever. GPS, got two cup holders, a windshield again, like I told you, no, no, no flaws in there. This window may have a little bit of fog, okay? Uh, but mirrors, the rear view mirrors, you can see them from the front two windshield, so don't worry about it, but it's got a slide fog on this side, and a driver's side may have it. I like to mention all my flaws too. All right, both seats are powered seats. Uh, driver and passenger, flex steel furniture. One of the armrests is missing, it's sits somewhere in a uh, compartment. I think it's here when they recovered it or something. All right, it's right here. All right, we got a sofa that opens up in the bed. So if you see what I'm talking about, it pulls out all the way out here and become full bed. Uh, there are two chairs. I don't know. You could get a couple of chairs. I don't know how that opens up or not. I'm sure it may open up and become extra leaf in there. I don't know. I haven't seen it, but take a look at my pictures. If you see it, it's there. If you don't, then it may not do it. Got little uh, extension right here for Corian countertops, dual sinks, ceramic sinks, pull-out sprayer, really good shape. If you know anything about Newmar, they make good quality coaches, beautiful woodwork. Oh, there's some books and records right here, owner's manuals are right here. Convection oven, three burner gas stove, Exhaust fan up top, lots of cabinet right here for storage. Four door refrigerator, take a, take a look at it. Looks like previous owner may have put some stain on it, but it looks sharp, <laughs> really, really sharp. Four door refrigerator with ice maker, outside water dispenser, uh, works properly. We had to uh, change a cooling unit and it. it's got new cooling unit. So there you go, everything works. We're gonna make sure all the major component works before you take off from here. Uh, let's see, center part of the coach, oh, by the way, I'd like to mention there's a little bit more uh, counter space, wine cooler area, more storage under there. Uh, center part of the coach, we have a private toilet, china, electric flusher, exhaust fan, a little cabinet back there, towel rack. Oh, by the way, there was a pocket door here for privacy. Nice shower area. Everybody can fit in here. I'm about six feet. You could be six one, six two. You could still easily take shower in here. Sink with a little bit of counter space. Medicine cabinet, pretty deep. Got some storage under here. And this is the last but not the least, but take, take a look at this. Bedroom has a two slides. Plenty of room and lots of lighting. It's dark night, but it's got big bay window, emergency exit window, window here with a day and night shades. Day, day and night shades in a good shape too. No stain, no condensation. Nice window treatment around there. Uh, over here, another window. So it's got plenty of windows and two more windows around the bed. So plenty of window to let daylight come in. Uh, over here, got a little table. I guess you could put a couple of chairs or have one recliner here for nighttime, sleepy time tea or playing cards. Imagination, imagination is endless. So nice bedroom area. Got some more storage under there, some storage on side, storage up top. Those two windows I was talking about on both sides, there's a bulb missing. We, we'll check some stuff out, but I like to, uh, let, me, let me emphasize, this motorhome is going to be sold under wholesale. Say so it will not last too long. We'll make sure everything works out of the door. 
and uh, if bulb missing you can put bulb in it or we'll we'll give you bulb okay so you know maybe sometimes the switches go bad and they're five dollar switches i like to mention everything all right uh over here we have a coat closet let me turn some lights on Newmark does great great job put lights in it I've, I've seen some motorhomes you open up a closet no light you know uh you can put those stick on but this one has it uh lots of lots of uh storage under here we have drawers two story drawers all all the way through it, it still have older style tvs well, a few hundred bucks you can put new lcd tv they're very cheap nowadays i have rv tech can help you to put on if you want to hire somebody i know someone got a privacy door for bath uh, bedroom uh this is about to conclude our video presentation on this 2005 newmar mountain air model 3743 the cheapest one on internet i double dare you to go to google and check it out we're probably at least ten thousand dollars cheaper if not more i return my text and email promptly sometimes i can't answer the phone so call me until you get a hold of me or text me at 864-404-0054 that number again is 864-404-0054 or you can call me on my 888-352-2316 that's my toll free number 888-352-2316 Thank you for your time watching this video and look forward to earning your business. Have a great day.